Hi and welcome. In this video I'm going to help you understand the business value of Zenworks Configuration Management 2017. The core business value is that it helps you save time and money. It does this by reducing the time it takes to migrate, manage, and deploy all of your devices, policies, and applications by using a single management console and a truly unified management approach. And it allows you to leverage your existing IT skills and infrastructure investment by allowing you to share a common infrastructure and be able to select platforms and services that are built on your existing investment. For instance, you can host the primary server on Windows or Linux or a virtual appliance. You can use Active Directory or eDirectory as your user source. And you can use Sybase, which is the included database, or Oracle or SQL based on the internal skill set you have and the licenses. Let's take a look at what this unified experience looks like. So here you'll see I have the new Zenworks 2017 console, and right here I now see servers, workstations, and for the first time I now see mobile devices. And so within my console, everywhere I can see devices, I can now see mobiles. If I drill into one of these mobile devices, I can see all of its details, I can see its battery, I can see some of the services available, whether it's roaming, all of those kinds of things. When I create policies, I now have new policies that are for mobile, or I can do policies for desktops. This one happens to be a mobile policy where you can set password and such. So inherently built into the system, you can manage all of these devices and you manage them in a very consistent fashion, meaning you don't have to learn how to do this for desktops one way and mobile devices another. Second, we help you increase IT efficiency by using Zenworks as a force multiplier, allowing thousands of devices to be managed by a handful of IT staff, largely without leaving their desks. We do this through full application and device lifecycle management, and we allow you to manage by exception instead of managing each device or user independently. So back in the console, I'll show you a little bit about what this looks like. So today, for instance, in devices, I can build out a rich structure that mimics my department, my geography, however I want to mix and match that. I can set up groups that are role-based. I can set up dynamic or static groups. Dynamic groups are groups based on certain attributes of the device or the user. So here you can see I have all my employee-owned devices in one folder, all my corporate-owned. That way I can apply policies and say, generally speaking, for everybody who has a corporate-owned device, I want to apply this set of settings. And then if you have one device or one user that you need to override that for, you can do that. And again, this is consistent across whether you're in mobile devices or I go into workstations, I can have a different structure there that mimics what I need to do for my desktop devices. When I go into bundles, I actually have full lifecycle management. Most configuration management products actually stop at being able to deploy a piece of software. With Zenworks, once you've actually deployed the software, you have the ability to control the full life cycle of that software. So if I come in and take a look at some application here, you'll see I've got an application that launches the Zenworks Control Center. You have the Actions tab, and building a, an application with Zenworks is much easier than many other tools. You simply come in here and you add an ordered set of actions. So you might want to install an MSI or copy some files. And then that's what's going to happen on the first time the user clicks it. Then on launch, every time the user clicks that icon, you can do another set of things. So for instance, maybe you want to restore a file to make sure they have a pristine version of that template file or that XML configuration file every time they launch the application. You can easily do that. You can also deal with how the application gets repaired, which is verify control how it gets uninstalled, and you can even, if you've got a schedule associated with this, limit when that application can be running and schedule what happens if they run it past those hours. Additionally, Zenworks includes a full version of Flexera's Admin Studio Standard Edition and a standard version of Bundle Commander, which helps you with packaging and creation of bundles to make it even easier. Finally, we help you improve end-user productivity and satisfaction. We do this through identity-based management, which means you can deliver what the user needs, when they need it, on the device they need it, where they need it.
what this means is there's this unique combination of the user's identity, the device's identity, and the location where that user is at. And so you can control each of those separately. If a user walks up to a kiosk device, we can know it's a kiosk device and it shouldn't unlock itself. However, if they walk up to a general purpose device, you may then say, I want all of these policies or these applications that are associated to the user to be available on all general purposes devices. That way they can go to any machine and they'll be able to work from any of those machines. Additionally, it provides robust application self-service and a true workflow-enabled enterprise application store that allows users to provision applications themselves instead of depending on IT to do it for them. So I'll give you an example of what this looks like. This is the application launcher, or we call it the Zenworks user application. This is where the user is typically going to launch their applications. Additionally, you can deliver these icons right onto the start menu, the desktop, the taskbar. Here you'll see I don't have Microsoft Word. If I wanted to request Microsoft Word, I have the application store that I've set up and you can see I've branded this. It's very easy to rebrand. And I can say, well, what I need is Microsoft Word. I can then create a request for that. And based on the workflow that's based on your business process, that will then submit a request. In my case, that submits a request to my boss. And so if I log into this as my boss, you'll see there is a new request from Angie, which is who I'm logged in as. And so I can come in here as her manager. I can say, I approve that. That will then accept that request. Because of my workflow, it will actually then go to an owner of the application to make sure there is a license available and also to make sure that the application owner agrees that they need it. So you'll see that happens here in the system. And I can then go ahead as the application owner and say, I also approve that. That's the end of the workflow that's been created for this particular application. And so now what will happen is it'll actually take and assign that application over to the user. You can see that that was assigned successfully. And so now as the end user, if I come in and refresh, or normally this would happen just on the next normal refresh, the application will now be delivered to Angie, who's logged in here, and we'll see the Microsoft Word application show up and we can launch it. So there you see Microsoft Word, we'll double click that and it goes ahead and launches. So there you have it, the demonstration of all the core business value. We can save you time and money, we can increase your IT efficiency, and we can help you improve end user productivity and satisfaction, all with Zenworks Configuration Management 2017.